Hey peeps, Claudia King here, founder of Automio, creator of ScaleUp and award-winning legal innovator. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a fantastic lead magnet for your law firm. Before I get into that though, please stick around to the end of this video. I'm going to share with you how to get your hands on the five most effective marketing strategies that innovative law firms are using at the moment. These strategies are easy to implement and will help your law firm get more clients. All right, let's get into it. So peeps, here is the deal. A lot of law firm owners are getting really frustrated because they can see that quite a lot of people are visiting their law firm's website, but those people are leaving their website without making contact, without calling or emailing or booking an appointment. So the question I get asked a lot is, once those people leave the website, how can I get them back? So the answer to that is to collect their contact details while they're still on the website. And the most effective way of doing that is through using a lead magnet. So what is a lead magnet? A lead magnet is a valuable piece of content that people visiting your website will download in exchange for giving you their email address. And the reason you really want the email address is so that you can add them to your mailing list and you can nurture them along the buying journey so that you can turn them in, you can turn them from potential client into paying client by nurturing them with a series of emails. But the question then is how do you create a valuable piece of content that people coming to your website actually want to download? So I want to share with you my three-step framework for how to create a fantastic lead magnet for your law firm. So step number one is to focus on the pain. So when people come to your law firm's website, it's because they have some sort of problem or they're experiencing some sort of life event and they are thinking about getting the help of a lawyer. So it's really, under, it's really important to understand what that problem or that life event is and be able to explain it in the words of the, the, the client or the people coming to your website. And focusing on the pain is a lot more effective than focusing on something that your ideal client wants or needs. Focusing on a pain point, on a pain or problem rather than a want or a need is a much more effective way of marketing and creating uh, valuable content for your ideal client. So I'll give you an example of this. When I had my law firm, we had an online conveyancing service for first home buyers. And one of our ideal clients' biggest pain points was that when they were looking around and searching for their first home, they would get really anxious about talking to the real estate agent, about you know potentially signing their first contract because they were aware that there's so many sort of trips and traps for first home buyers and they didn't want to fall into one. So what we did is we created a lead magnet called uh, 10 Mistakes First Home Buyers Make and How to Avoid Them. So you can see there that we really focused on that pain point that first home buyers had of making some sort of mistake, some sort of silly mistake that they just didn't know about. So that's an example of how we really focused in on that pain. So the important thing for you to know there is that really understand the, the pain points and the problems that people are coming to your website with so that you can create something for them that addresses that problem. So step number two is it must, your lead magnet must solve an urgent need. So you now understand what your ideal client's pain points are. So the lead magnet needs to solve those problems for them and that will get them to download it. So I gave you the example before of the first home buyer's guide that we had 10 mistakes first home buyers make and how to avoid them so that and how to avoid them but that's really the bit about how we solved an urgent need. So not only did we tell them what the mistakes are, we actually told them how to actively avoid them so that they went forward into open homes talking to real estate agents and, and knew what mistakes were out there and how they could actively go about avoiding them. 
So step number three is your lead magnet must target a specific type of client. So it's really important that when you're addressing a problem and then presenting a solution to that problem that it is for a specific type of client because if you don't focus on a specific client type your message is just going to get lost in the wash because it won't resonate with your ideal client because it won't feel like you're talking specifically to them. So if we go back to the example of our guide for first home buyers on the 10 mistakes that first home buyers make and how to avoid them. So that guide was specifically for first home buyers. And because it was really specific, it wasn't fit for home buyers or for people, um, you know, for buyers and sellers. It was for specifically for first home buyers. So anybody who was a first home buyer knew that that guide was specifically for them. And so they're more likely to download it and give you their email address. And that email address is, an, is, is a really important um, part of your marketing campaign because, like I said, you can then nurture them along the buying journey. So just to cover those three steps again to creating a fantastic lead magnet for your law firm, step one is to focus on the pain. Don't focus on needs and wants, focus on the pain that people are coming to your website with, whatever they want help with from a lawyer, that's you know, really focus on that pain in their words. Step two is it solves a specific need. So they come to you with a problem, you need to solve a specific need with your lead magnet. And number three is that your lead magnet targets a specific client type. So get really specific about who the lead magnet's for and make the title of the lead magnet really clear about who the lead magnet is for. Now I promised you if you stayed to the end of this video, I would share with you the five strategies on how to do marketing that are working right now. So to get your hands on those five strategies, you can click down below to get all the details. As always, I want to challenge you to build your dream law firm so that you can create the impact, freedom and money that you really want in your lawyer life. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. If there's anything these past months have shown us, it's that the time to make lasting, impactful change in the legal industry is right now. So I want to challenge you to shake things up and create change today. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and share this video with your lawyer friends. See you next week.